Dr. Fenn, I'm so glad we could be here together today at the Arboretum here at James Madison University. And we're here today to talk a little bit about, obviously, United Way. And so I'd like to ask you a few questions, if that's OK. Absolutely. Let's talk about a good thing that happens in our community and in our school system every year. Sounds great. Tell me a little bit, Dr. Fenn, about your involvement with the United Way. Um, the United Way has been an active and an in instrumental part of Rockingham County Schools and our employee giving for a long, long time. Uh, Tammy, as you know, our employment employee giving has increased over the past years, and we continue to participate in United Way Day of Caring that happens each spring. We've had wonderful teams of employees that go out, put on their dirty clothes, and do some real home improvement projects or work in yards and gardens and, and just make a difference right here in our own community. So our involvement has been terrific as a school division to know that you can give to our community those monies that you give, the work, the effort, uh, stays right here in our community. Right. And um, that's very special. As you know, United Way is near and dear to my heart. There are so many agencies in the United Way that I want to be a part of, and I know many, many staff members are part of. Um, for example, Big Brothers Big Sisters, that plays a big role in the lives of young children. To have positive adult role models being involved, being involved in children's lives. The other thing that I think about as an administrator are some of the local agencies that benefit our families, such as the Collins Center, the Blue Ridge Area Food Bank. Um, the Harrisburg Rockingham Daycare, Plains Area Daycare. Without these organizations, our children wouldn't have a place to go either before school or after school. So again, that's United Way. Thank you, Tammy, for your leadership, and thank you, Rockingham Schools employees, for giving so that those agencies can help our family, can help our community, and make a really tremendous difference. Absolutely. And then when I think about this upcoming campaign, it runs December 1 through 21 here in Rockingham County Schools, I think about folks that have said, I really want to give and I want to give more. And by all means, the more you give, the more it benefits more people. So Dr. Fenn, what are some of the specifications for how that works this year? This year in our window of giving, which again will be December, December 1st till our winter break, uh, all of our employees will have an opportunity for payroll deduction, to sign up for payroll deduction for the remainder of the year, or even just to write a check if they want to give a single gift um, prior to year end. So either way, uh, we hope to increase our giving. We always want to make a difference. Again, those dollars stay right here in Rockingham and Harrisonburg. And so um, it's, it's a great thing. It's just wonderful to give. And my experience, Tammy, with our school employees has been that they are the most giving and most mm -hmm. caring. Um, our teachers give, uh, they tutor, they work with children and families, as do all of our employees. We just have a very caring spirit in Rockingham County Schools. Yes, we do. It makes me proud to be a part of Rockingham County Schools and United Way. And more so, it makes me happy to be here today with you to talk about the United Way. So let's all live united and let's make sure that this year we give as much as we're able to help this very worthwhile organization. Thank you, Tammy, and thank you, Rockingham County Schools. We want to live united. We appreciate your efforts and your gifts.